I don't like hearing my own voice. It's basically a reminder that I'm not normal. I was eight when I was diagnosed with leukemia. Complications with the medications led to brain damage, which brought a loss of motor functions on my right and a toxic driver. Uh, do that.
Although I've lived with my disability for the greater half of my life, I've often ran from my identity as a person with disability. Not physically running, of course. Um, can't really do that. I wanted to make my film project about this part of myself as a way to dive into this community. I reached out to my community from the Cambridge Commission for Persons with Disabilities. And he invited me to their monthly board meeting. You'll see that there seems to be always some sort of food here. Um. Why don't we start with introductions? Since he's holding a camera, I will introduce Simon's son, who is a, a student doing a film project here. Um, my name is Gary Demetric. I'm the chair of the commission. I'm Kate Thurman, project coordinator. Michael Mewey, disability commission director. Still good, good day, board member. Don Summerfield, alternate board member. Jack Albert, I'm the liaison from the police department. Beth MacArthur, board member. Luis Loya, board member. Katie Ashwell Allen, board member. Mike Langlois, board member. Okay, um, <clears throat> I thought, let's see, I thought we'd begin by looking ahead to next month. Um, but I do want to bring up, um, and maybe you can talk a little bit more about the um, variance request for the gelato store that um, you did a little bit of investigation on. Okay. <coughs> so this is the one with the doorbell, yeah. right? So um, this was is on the corner um, of 50 JFK Street, and it is... Um, when we, we first heard about it, I was concerned it might have been one of the ones a few down, which have like stairs that go down into more of a, of a, of a recessed area, which would maybe make access harder. But when I looked at the place and took some pictures, it's actually on the corner. It's where the Burks store used to be um, and has a street that's basically level with the sidewalk and then an, a foyer in the actual building, which has plenty of space. Um, so uh, it seems like there would be lots of reasons where, with a little creativity, people could actually do something more than what they've proposed, which is apparently, and correct me if I'm wrong, to have a doorbell so that if someone has mobility access, they can ring the doorbell and someone will come get them. Um, I don't think they have a sense of how insensitive and insulting that is. Um, I think we've been trying to be kind of measured in our response. But um, the pictures and the assessment I've got clearly indicate there's a lot more that can be done there. The board meeting was my first interaction with the disabled community since I started in college. Huh? 
，那个，我问你，你有没有我的生命中的照片？干啥用啊？啊？我那个 video 用。有啊，可惨的照片。哈哈。我给你找找，有可惨的。啊。在啥笔记本儿，啥的啥的。哎，嗯。嗯。对呀。Yeah. yeah, I think we can win. Four v five. With the feeling, Jing. Uh, should I go die or what? Okay. All right. Usually, from the inside, my voice sounds normal to me. But hearing it back now, it reinforces this part of my identity. Maybe I don't need subtitles after all.